You ready? Every August. I got it in a long time, Dad. Milestones start sinking in in Target's busiest aisles. Elmer's glue stick. Where dads realize what they've been saying is true. Time just flies by so fast. This week, their babies are headed to kindergarten. It seems like just yesterday, <laughs> those same girls were babbling. <gasps> when she was one, Carolyn Yoho was walking. She'll fall over and over and over again and not cry and still do anything she can to get through a gator. Get up the stair. A determination she got from her mom, Laura, who, even while battling a brain tumor, never gave up. It doesn't matter what they tell me. I realize, I, I know mentally that that I, I'm good. You know, I'm still, I'm still ready to go. Doctors gave Laura a 3% chance, but she kept persisting and planning. So much so that everything in her obituary was spelled out. Even the line reading, Laura is survived by her daughter, Carolyn, due to be born through surrogacy. Her husband, Nate, knew it'd be tough, but... She was such an amazing person that, you know, I think a piece of her deserves to live on. Four months after Laura died, her final wish came true. I just got a piece of Laura back to sell. Within an hour of Carolyn's birth, her dad promised. She's going to know how hard her mother um, tried to be there for her and what kind of person that she was. And I hope she looks just like her and acts just like her and I can tell her all about her mom. Sure like enough. I, her and Laura have the same eyes and the mouth are pretty similar too. So. That same girl, who's now five and a half, reminds her dad of his wife every day. When you see it, it's like, whoa, you know, that, was, that was her right there. Even when she looks up at Nate. I never met, don't know a thing, so it's really cool to see those just natural things come out in her. Like when she falls at the playground. She still gets back up and with a smile on her face, and, and it's kind of in the, the same story of, of Laura, you know, battling with her cancer. This one. Carolyn admits kindergarten makes her kind of nervous. But she has a plan. I just pretend I'm a princess. Mm -hmm. What princess? Princess Peach. From? Mario. Eventually, the girl in the bow will learn more about her mom. Yeah. <laughs> but now that her school shopping's done. Um, it's right over there next to the glow in the dark blue. Where? Over there. Mrs. Kirk's kindergarten class better be ready. Laura Yoho's little girl is just as determined as the mom she never got to meet. So you now you're ready to go? Yeah. I think. We're ready. Carolyn is so polite when we complimented her on her cute dresses and hair bows. She said thanks and told us she might wear one Friday when classes begin at Dallas Center Grimes. Eric Hansen, KCCI 8 News, Iowa's News Leader.